What's happened is, in my view, too much focus on international institution building and international treaties. So in the current era of sort of rollback of human rights, the rise of populism in Western Europe and the United States, the key thing is to try to get Western publics to put pressure on their own governments to meet and extend their human rights obligations. So back to basics, less time in The Hague, less ICC and R2P, and more time spent trying to get uh, powerful governments to, to honour even basic human rights commitments. I think there's a whole human rights movement which is out there, which relies on these texts to save people who are being tortured, being arbitrarily detained, being raped, war crimes and so on. So the idea that we should abandon the treaties and look for another way to deal with the world, I faintly find a bit ridiculous. Um, clearly the situation in Syria is absolutely atrocious and there are human rights violations going on, but that doesn't mean for the rest of the world, the other 190 so countries, uh, human rights have gone out of the window and there aren't human rights challenges every day and that human rights aren't from time to time respected there precisely because of human rights law.